welcome back to another video guys today's video will be the battle battle of the uh energy drinks i hear did you hear i got g fuel i got tropical rain and ninja's cotton candy now there is another variety another flavor of cotton candy that isn't really great um i've had that one it's not great and i have tried these two tropical rain and g fuel and i like them a lot while our other contestant is W. It is, is a new energy drink formula, new energy drink company, not formula. Um, I've had, this is the only bottle, only tub of W I've had, uh, and the results are about the same. Flavor-wise, I have to give it to G Fuel. They have a lot more flavors. They have a lot more variety. They have, they do have hydration tubs. Now the only problem with these energy tubs, I forgot to mention that W does not have artificial colors while G Fuel does, because the liquid in W is clear while G Fuel has different colors in their drinks. Back to the video. These, with these two energy tubs, are the fact that they don't tell you the actual um, daily value. They don't, they don't tell you what the recommended daily percent or value for each scoop is. Um, I mean, you can tell there's some labels here, uh, but there's no daily value, actual daily value on both of these energy drinks. So uh, that's the bad thing if you're wanting to know if they're healthy or not. They're just a supplement to boost your energy, your endurance and your focus so g fuel they say this drink will help energy focus endurance and reaction times so if you have a slow reaction times they say they can help um i don't i don't see a change in my reaction times um i mean w is the exact same thing but they claim it is a jitterless energy blend so uh, this one contains coffee, fruit extract. Some of the flavors on W will contain coffee, coffee fruit ex extract, um, even though it has no caffeine. It has vitamin C, vitamin B3, niacin, um, vitamin B6, and vitamin B12. Uh, while G Fuel has a crap ton of stuff, um, it, uh, G Fuel does have 140 milligrams of caffeine, which is not even, which is, if I'm correct, correct me down in the comments, um, not even a cup of coffee. So, that, I mean, that's good. I mean, what I'm looking at right now is that G Fuel has B6, vitamin B6, vitamin B12, um, choline, and sodium. Niacin, vitamin E, and vitamin C, or assortic acid. Um, G Fuel does have that, while W does not have, they have vitamin C. So, um, I guess you can compare the two. They, they both have a, around the same vitamins, such. But the big differential between these two companies is the variety. G Fuel has a lot of tubs, a lot of hydration tubs, a lot of shaker cups, a lot of apparel. They've been around for a while. W is actually like a new company that's coming into the market. I mean, it's like Ghost. They're and and they're not energy, but they're supplements. These are supplements. Um, uh, these have, I guess, another big difference is. G Fuel has 40 servings per uh, per scoop, while W only has 30. 30 servings per scoop, and the the difference is I don't have as much jitters from W as I do G Fuel because this actually has like literal caffeine, while W does not have any sort of caffeine. It has coffee fruit extract, which I probably that has to be. Uh, caffeine, but I don't know. Um, but it, I mean, in the, um, 
in the fat and the supplement facts just says whole coffee fruit extract so 100 milligrams of that so there's no caffeine in w there's caffeine in g fuel and that's the big difference between these two companies sorry that's the difference between these two companies the fact that these two have caffeine this doesn't but it has coffee fruit extract so that's what i like about w um the only bad thing about w is they don't have as many flavors um they have a starter pack they have one hydration tub stickers hats i mean you name it uh but g fuel has collector tubs collector boxes um apparel you name it they have a bigger following than w because they've been around a lot they've been around a lot more so which one would i choose between g fuel and w it's this hard one but i'm gonna have to go w since this has no caffeine in it but it does have coffee fruit extract so that has to have some sort of caffeine but it's not labeled it's not it's not on the supplement fact as caffeine while this has uh, 140 milligrams of caffeine so you're gonna have some jitters but that's i mean that's really it the big differences um again the big differences are g fuel has a lot more flavors and a lot more of a following more than w um and you can you can sign up for partnership with both of these i am actually partnered with w so um i guess i am a little biased but i've had both of these drinks um and I do like W more. It's not as powdery as G Fuel, and it doesn't have um, as much um, of a following as G Fuel does. Because if I'm being honest with you, G Fuel's kind of overhyped. Because it's not really that great, but it's not really that bad. It's not good or bad. So, but also I do want to mention the scoops. The scoops. For G Fuel, they're massive. They're absolutely massive. Oh shoot! <gasps> While Dubby's um, scoops are so small, but it's thirty. I mean, but then again, it's thirty, um, thirty servings. But yeah, the difference between I guess these two companies is the fact that the scoop sizes are smaller so you get more bang for your buck um they so they're also big difference is price if you want to buy some g fuel um i'll actually link i actually won't link i'll actually put the prices above my head but they are expensive they're not terribly expensive it's not like red bull or if you get a case of Red Bull, it's like $500. I'm just exaggerating, but these energy drinks are expensive. Um, you can find G Fuel. You can find G Fuel at your local Walmart, um, uh, GNC. That's really all the places I can find it right now is Walmart and GNC. I forgot to mention that you can only find W at W.com. Not in any stores. Um, they also, and by variety, what I also was meaning by variety was g fuel has cans cans of this and i've had the cans of g fuel and there's there's really nothing different between the powder and the carbonation side there's really no difference just one's less powdery than the other so um but yeah that is my review on g fuel versus w if you guys like this video then comment down below what you guys want me to um, battle next. What what companies you want to battle next. And uh, yeah, thank you for watching. Subscribe if you're new and uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. As post-production here, I just wanted to let you know that if you go down in the link description, uh, you can get my code jmason23 for 10% off any order at w.com. Thank you for W for sponsoring this video.